standing on Alexandrovsky Prospect, the area uh, which has some dark history uh, and which is known uh, for being part of Odessa's massacre in 1941. By Odessa's massacre, we mean the following. Um, in June 1941, when World War II started, almost half of population of Odessa were Jews. Hmm. Evacuation was not really well planned, so about half percent, uh, about 50 percent of Odessa's population managed to be evacuated. Jews, Russians, communists, etc. But lots of Jews uh, were trapped, basically, in the city. Especially senior people who left in the city to guard their property. So when the Nazis came, there were about uh, uh, 200,000 Jews hmm. in Odessa. People who were hiding in catacombs, partisans, blew up the head office of the Nazi army. As a retaliation on that, Nazis were running around the city catching women, children, families of communists and Jews. Only about 200 Nazis died. But Nazis said that for every soldier we're gonna kill 200 civilians. Mm -hmm. And for every officer we're gonna kill 300 civilians. So, as a result of that, about 5,000 Jews were hung on both sides of this... Hung? On both sides of this prospect. Mm -hmm. So, the prospect covers, from left to right, about five blocks. Mm -hmm. So, the bodies of people were just uh, hanging on each side of the street. Mm -hmm. Did they bury them in a common grave, or... I don't know what, was, uh, what happened. It's Alexandrovsky Prospect. The territory which is famous for for the massacre everything here is counterfeit and this is the place in the 90s where you came to exchange rubles their black market get whatever you needed yeah.